Today I would like to show you the extension we just made to import product from Spotsoft to Magenta. From this website using API key to Magenta. So I'm gonna go, that's the extension. Here to put the information that you get from Spotsoft. Customer number, username and password, and then you click Save Access. Then you don't need to retype every time you import. Here we made something new. We also add that to the root core extension. Now you can select where you want to import all the product. If you put default category, so you're gonna put all this like this other category here so if you want to put that under one category so you can go to catalog manage category i'm gonna open that in youtube here first you need to select the default category and now we can do add subcategory. Do, do not click here. This is gonna add another route that's only for multi-store. After you select the default category, you click subcategory. Let's call that test. It's active. Click subcategory. I will show here. Now if you go back to the extension, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, when you open that, you're gonna see test. So if I select this and I do import category, all this category is gonna be under the test category. So we already import all the category and all the products. But when you get the extension in the beginning, before you import, you're not gonna see all this. You won't gonna see that. So after you put your information, you click category import, it's gonna take like one minute, two minutes to import all the category and all the subcategory. By default, all this category is gonna be disabled, inactive. And after you select the category you want to import, after you select what category you want to import, this category is gonna be active and it's gonna show on your website. If it if the category that you don't import, it's gonna be inactive, so it's not gonna show here. It's gonna be like this gray. So you can click one to select all, or click again to disconnect. If you want just to import some subcategory, you need to uncheck the main category and then select what subcategory you want to import. But do not check here. If you check here, you're gonna import all this category. So to do only a few subcategory, you must to uncheck here and select here. Uh, we we import by default the map price, the minimum price it's allowed to sell. If you want to end percent, so you can click here five, six, seven eight percent. If there is any product that doesn't have a map price, so the price that import is gonna be the cost times two. So if you want to add more, 
so you can put like 5 10 percent it means it's gonna be the cost price times 2 plus 5 or 10 percent here you can do if the price is very low if the price is less than it's less than ten dollar and you want to add fixed price like five dollar you can do that here in this extension we put the automatic import in one extension if you saw my road core we have to we have road core manual and we have auto from now on we're gonna put that in one extension so if it's if it check here it's gonna run every day and this time pm but for this to be able to run you must have a url to the cron job and then this is gonna work after you make your selection you click save setting and click start import so we already import all the product and we got uh, 32,000 and show you we got 31 746 product that you see here let you go if I go you can see all the product all the product from uh, sports of import that here by the API key it's huge it's a huge amount take a lot of time like 20 hours or something to import all this just one thing I want to say when you use the manual import after you put your information you select what you want to import you must to leave this windows open if you want to use to go your website so you just click new tab and you can go wherever you want but don't close these windows because it's using javascript to run the script and if you close the window it's gonna stop to import but if you do an automatic import after you put the cone job and you do enable import and you put your time you click self setting you can close the windows but manual import only work when this window is open if you want to go to other website just like I said click new tab and keep uh, do whatever you want thank you good luck